This video will give you a sneak preview of the new GXP Explorer coming at the end of the year. The GXP Explorer landing page streamlines the web interface with a simple search box and customizable background. Swap out the default background with one of the images included. Or upload your own image to give your landing page a unique look and feel. Use the free text search box to do simple keyword searches. The search page is a new feature and provides a list view of search results with simple map and overview panels. The typespace searching has been improved with the new search by box. From here you can still access advanced search fields to search for specific metadata attributes such as NITIF tags. You can also perform searches within the current search to refine results. Save commonly used searches for easy access. The new Save Searches menu stores a history of recent searches. By selecting a search, you can review the search criteria and select options for running the search, such as RSS, Google Earth, and Standing Order. The Catalogs menu allows you to select other catalogs in your federation for search. The menu is now organized by catalogs that accept anonymous users and catalogs that require a username and password to access. The panels on the search page can be resized as needed. Change the view of the results to see the results in a list instead of as overviews. The status menu displays a list of recent downloads, uploads, and jobs. From here you can control processes that run on the GXP Explorer server like RSET and orthophoto generation. For geospatially referenced searches, the GXP Explorer map interface is used. The new map interface has been updated with a bigger map area on the screen. The background is also customizable and can easily be changed on the fly. The new Jump to Point allows you to enter in places by coordinates or name. Create a list of favorite places to quickly jump to frequently used locations. The same search menus are available in the map view as on the search page. From the search by menu, you can now search multiple areas of interest with a single query. The new GXP Explorer search display supports faceted searching and allows you to refine your results without requerying. You can also search within the current search and easily see how many results you have in a particular category. There are also new options for viewing data on the map. With the true coverage option, you can see a footprint representation of the results displayed. Toggling off different categories helps to visualize coverage areas. The visual display of map results is one of the biggest changes of the new GXP Explorer. This includes hover footprints, icons to represent different data types, and clustering to allow you to visualize all of the available results. Double clicking on a cluster will zoom in and provide a further breakdown of results. The time slider has also been updated in the new GXP Explorer. You can now zoom in and out to see results in greater detail. Zooming out to a certain extent will group results. Hovering over a grouping of results will give you a breakout by type. With the new product viewer you can view browse imagery and metadata by selecting a result icon. You can customize the product viewer to display metadata fields you're interested in and use the Show More menu to display all of the available metadata. Clicking on additional markers will populate the film strip within the product viewer. You can scroll through recently selected products, remove items from the film strip view, and select multiple items to order or process. Selecting the chip option from the toolbar brings up the chipping window. Specify the chip size and choose to chip in the original format or chip directly to PowerPoint. The product viewer is resizable and you can choose to move it to a different monitor to use the map and search functionality at the same time.
You can also minimize the viewer to isolate the film strip and toolbar. The toolbar menu contains a list of options for working with your data. From this menu, you can do many things like download or add results to the cart, view imagery in GXP Web, and run data processes. Drag and drop buttons and customize the display options to fit your needs. This concludes the sneak preview of the new GXP Explorer. Please contact us for more information.